Hello YouTube. In this video I'm going to be reviewing my new cell phone. It's an HTC G2 uh, with Google by T-Mobile. I just got this phone I would say like I think it was Tuesday so it's you know three days ago. Uh, this is my first my first smartphone um, and it comes with Android. Let me turn off the light that way um, we can see it. Okay, so let me I want to turn it on. I did root it already. Um, like I said, I, this is my first smartphone. This is the first phone I have with Android. So you know, I'm not really familiar, you know, with um, applications and stuff like that. But you know, I managed to to install um, you know some some routing and some applications and everything um, so this right here as you can see it's not the it's not the original one like I said I already rooted it um, it, it has ginger villain 1.5 I believe that's how you pronounce it um, let me open it okay so let me turn off the monitor of this computer that way we could see it a little better maybe. Okay, um yeah, so let me go to see I mean this thing's quick. Um Okay, so let me go to in settings, like I said, settings. Um about phone and as you can see right there it's running Android 3.2 uh, and it has I, I believe where is it okay right there mod version uh, ginger villain 1.5 and let me go show you guys uh, like I said I did overclock it so the like set CPU um, I've seen some people overclock it already all the way to um, 1.4 I believe 1.5 some people but you know I'm just for me this is my first phone um, you know I'm trying to keep it you know just eat simple and everything so I'm just gonna leave it at um, stock speed I believe it's 800 uh, so I just overclock it to 1017 um, and you know you could create profiles so that when the batteries and charging and everything you know the processor slows down that way it doesn't waste that much battery um, let me show some applications this quadrant let me run a benchmark right here as you can see that thing goes really quick already so I could just imagine it being at 1.4 like I said some people have it and it being really quick it being really quick so let this application finish Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's doing a graphics test. You know, it's just doing a regular benchmark. Mm. Let's see. And okay, well, this is doing like a like I I really like that. You know, I, I was thinking I'm like, should I get a smartphone or not? You know. And I let me see. Uh, you can't really see it. Okay, let me turn the light on while that thing's running. This right here used to be my phone. It's a T-Mobile Tap, um, and that was before. But and then th this was also good. You know, I mean, I really just used to text on, and that's it. But now, you know, I've been getting you know more computers and everything so uh, you know like my customers and everything so you know I have to help them out and sometimes I'm not you know in the in my computer or let's say I need internet somewhere or stuff like that so uh, that's why I got this phone so as you can see right here this is my benchmark right here it says your device it's core 1648 uh, and then right here it has like some other stock phones you know the stock speed like the 
Motorola Joy X 2.2. You know, it scores that much. There's a Joy. Um, number the first Joy, I guess. You know, so I mean, this right here is really fast, and it is G3. I mean, G4. So internet's also really fast. Let me run a speed test right here. Where's the speed test? Uh, um, okay, like you can see right there, I have log me in. You know, control remote control my computers. Um, where's that speed test? I think I I not seen it. Oh, there it is. Speed test. Speed test. Okay, let it load. Begin. Mm -hmm. Okay, so look at the speed of that's on the phone itself, but I'm getting about three. I got like around three megabytes. Um, that's faster than some people's DSL, you know, and upload speeds around like 1.2, which is really good. Um, you know, I mean, if I'm probably outside and getting better signal, it could probably get better. Um, but that's good for me. And like I said, let me go back to home. Uh, as you can see, you know, like I custom put themes and everything. Let me see where's my games right here. Let me play that game, Angry Birds. Let's see, so. It loads. It looks pretty fast, you know. See, let me go back out. Um, let's see what else. Oh, the thing that I did see, you know, with this routing. So let me see right here. Um, let me see this right here. You see this keyboard? This keyboard right here is changes. I don't have the swipe thing anymore, but I really wasn't using it. Um, and then this keyboard is the Android keyboard, I guess. You know, I like how when you're typing something, you know, it says like right here or wait, hold on. Um, it goes right there, you know, like, it's, I mean, it's, it's really good as a touch, touch screen, you know, keyboard, but I'm more of a person that uses the actual keyboard itself. So this is easier for me. Uh, the keys, you know, I don't have really big hands but you know it's 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 good for me I mean I haven't um, you know you don't accidentally press any other key or stuff like that um, so that's good I like the keyboard the um, the keyboard the virtual touch keyboard I like that too um, let's see what else yeah so see right now the processor um, because the battery is getting low so it went down. I don't know. If you could see that. You know, the processor. You could have it. You know, the profiles and everything. So that's good. Mm, let's see. And like I said, I mean, I really like this because, for example, I could. Let's say I'm outdoors. You know, on a track meet or something. I could turn that on. Do press it. Tethering allowed. Um, unable to. OG Tether, please try again. Okay, I believe I have to go in over here first. To so settings, um, Wi-Fi, uh, Tether, um, Tether right there. Turning Tether on. Oops, I wasn't showing that right. Okay, so portable hotspot, Android activated. Let me go back. Right there. Back to applications, right there. Start tethering. Oh, uh, it's not letting me. Um. Okay, there. I think it let me already. So, um, let's go to my. I'm gonna leave my phone right here, and I'm gonna go back to my laptop, which I have it over here. So right here, let me turn it on. Right here I have my um, triple E PC 
10,000 HE. Um, let me go into let me go into uh, network right here. I'm on Eric's computer, so that this is my local network. If I let me open Chrome. So, oops. Let me open Chrome. Let me go to speed speedtest.net speedtest.net okay so let that run uh, begin test so this is just gonna test the speed of my internet as you can see uh, let that run so as you can see right there um, that's my roadrunner uh, it's not focusing my Roadrunner, okay, and what was the score? 21 megabytes. That's not a lot. It usually goes to like 25. But, um, yeah. So, upload speeds. This is another thing that I really like, the upload speed. So, on, on this, on my home network, it's 1.6. And, uh, and it was, I got 21 download. Okay, so let me close that. Let me go back into my settings. Um, right here, Android. So that's my phone right there. Connect to it. Let that connect. So it's connecting to it. Let me see if I could open. Um, okay. So let me see. There you go. So it's connected to my the laptop. Connected to my Android, and from my Android, I'm getting internet. So let me go back into over here. Google. Uh, that's what you need. Okay, let me go to the same place. Speed test. Speed test right there. Mm, and like you can see, so let me start the test. Let that thing start. And let me zoom in right here. You guys can see. Uh, now I'm instead of being on Roadrunner, I'm in T Mobile. So that means that I'm using the cell phone's internet. And you look at that speed. That's my internet speed on my cell phone. So I'm I mean I'm getting the I'm getting the internet from my cell phone into my computer. And that's really useful for me because you know sometimes like I said I'm at track meets or you know fixing somebody's computer or just you know not home. And you know, if you guys know me, I'm always taking my laptop like everywhere I go. So now I could take my laptop, and you know, I'll have really good internet. Like this is I, this is good for me um, if I'm out, you know, outdoors or something like that. When I'm home, you know, of course I need something faster. But yeah, so that's that right there. Mm, let me go back to the cell phone. So let me go back to the cell phone. Okay, so here it is. Uh -huh. Let me focus this. Oh, sorry, sorry. Okay, so yeah, so like I said, this is I've really enjoyed this cell phone for like I said, I've only had it like around three days now, but I'm really enjoying it. It's it's working really good. Um, I haven't had any problems with it. Um, yeah, so I would really recommend it, especially if you get it rooted, like I did. Um, you know, you could probably take a lot of things. You know, you know, if you guys could post comments or stuff like that about you know good applications out there that you know that you guys recommend. You know, let me know. And yeah, okay, thank you. Thanks for watching.